Welcome to a thing here on Split Screen. Uh, as you might have noticed, our channel is sort of missing like Wednesday. Wednesday was supposed to be like our, hey, let, let's check out this new game sort of slot. Uh, unfortunately, we've all just been playing old games. So I'm going to just play an old game. How about that? Fallout 4. There's nothing really going going down. I have m many, m many mods in this game. M many. As you can see, I've got uh, Mark and Buff Codsworth. Look at how buff he is. Oh, yeah! Bro, do you even lift? Mm, nope, let's not do that. No one likes that. Uh, yeah, so... We're just on a clear this area quest, I believe. Yeah, so let's clear the area. There's a fair core right there. Not anymore. It's dead. Oh Jesus. I have all these allies. I don't I don't know if I actually need them. Uh but they're really good for carrying stuff. I should also say that this is on uh, Horizon Survival, uh, so the game should be oh, bowling ball harder uh, than than a game would normally be. Uh, but I I found that Horizon Survival works oops works really great. Uh, uh, wrong wagon. Shots. Horizon Survival works really great at the start. Uh, and then... I'm just having no luck with this. And then the deeper you get... Oops. Sweet. The uh, less it is a problem. I think that's probably just the case with Survival and Fallout 4 in general. Uh, the game tends to get... Hello, sir! Sir! Got him. Tends to get rather easy once you've learned. Uh, or more importantly, once you set up. So I had a tough time because I didn't want to set up in... Um... I didn't want to set up in Sanctuary for once, so I do that every time. So I set up in uh, Starlight instead, which requires a little bit more setup time. Uh, as it's not basically pre-built, where Sanctuary has everything you need. Uh, pretty much from the start people, uh, building materials, etc, etc. I don't think I've even gone back to Sanctuary and cleaned it up yet. Which is one of the things I have to do. Uh, yeah, what do I have to say about Fallout? Uh, I'm pretty much... I, I want to push through and finish this game real quick. Uh, because I'm about to get a new computer, and I don't want to remod it. So like I said, I have like 200 mods. Uh, and that would be a hell of a time to remod uh, the game. Fuck off, dude. Hmm. Yeah, so I should say in this video there will be oh shit, frame drops. Uh, a lot of it because just I've got that bum 970 and I'm doing lots of modding. We use a little more volume. So, 
the game does have some issues with loading things. Uh, Pre-war money. I don't want pelvis bones. And not not only with hello protectron. Uh, loading. Just a shitty room. Okay. Not only with just loading things, but with uh, picking what to load in which order. So I actually had a big problem with my uh, uh, with my game just not starting, terrible frame drops, and I had to lower it down to like medium quality, which is really unfortunate. All right, we're done here. Get out of here. Take his cigarettes. I need those. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I have all the DLCs installed in this game. I finished. Uh, is it the Wasteland Workshop one? Uh, the one where you go down to the vault? Vault Tech Calling? I think that's what the quest was called. Uh, and I just finished the Mechanist one. Uh, They're both kind of okay. I don't know. After like, like Morrowind and stuff, you you have to do a lot in a DLC to get me hype, especially for like thirty bucks. It's my let's let's talk real talk. Why don't I have any new games? It's because games cost like ninety dollars and expect you to spend another sixty to seventy dollars on DLC bullshit. I ain't got time for that. I'd rather just wait for the game to come out. I was kind of hyped for uh, Mass Effect, but eh, eh, I don't know. Uh, when I get the new computer, I think that might be one of the games I buy, just to just to see how like the new computer handles stuff. Because I'm not going to be obviously playing this game uh, with its load times. <laughs> uh, it is raining. And you turn the rain volume down. The fun bug in uh, the reverb mod, one of the sound mods I have. It just doesn't remember the sound settings. Okay, I think that quest was connected to. Yeah. Run. Run to Reese. Yeah, I think I've put like. 75 hours into this playthrough and because the leveling so slow in uh, in horizon like I don't I don't even have tier 4 mods yet so like there's some cool gear that I can technically make uh, or that I would be able to make at this time but uh, because I don't have the uh, I don't have the skills I can't so I'm just kind of rolling with whatever I found so far. It is probably a bit more like how you're actually supposed to play this game. Uh, where's that fuck? Nope. I hope here. your pooch knows where to do his business. Mark, Mark, uh, please. Your Excuse me. About time you showed your face. I take it that area is clear. Affirmative. Looks like I got my surprise for the day. Here's your. As long as the Brotherhood's around, those abominations don't stand a chance. Take a breather if you need it. When you're ready, just say the word. I'm ready. Better be. Details are on your map. Report back when the area is clear. All right. I have no idea. Uh, where to go now? <laughs> what I what I want to do? Uh, apparently I need to sleep and drink. Uh, where would be the best place to do that? Oh, gotta bring the fern flower to that guy. Uh, gotta go to Coop and figure it out. See what's going down in the insane asylum. Kind of want to go down to Summervale. see what's going on there uh, first I guess let's go home 
I, I have some things to drop off at home. So let's do that. I pretty much only travel uh, via Vertibird at this point. No point in traveling anything else. And as you see, I have a mod that gives me a butt ton of companions. I uh, accidentally told Nick to get into a. It appears to be an ally. Uh, to get into a power armor, and uh, apparently the multi follower mod is bugged with him, so now he is stuck in the power armor. I guess I could probably like fully out, like deck out his power armor at this point. <laughs> this game doesn't look half bad on medium. Looks okay. Oh shit. Oh, it's close. Spend the rest of the video trying to get out of a little pocket. Gotta pick stuff up. Yeah, I'm pretty much picking up everything that isn't uh, glued down. In fact, take all of this one. Since we're going back home. Uh, I found out that pre-war money is worth five bucks a piece and it doesn't weigh anything, so I now use it as currency. Oh, hello guys. What a waste of time. Yeah, I've kind of hit the point. I'll just... Like I said, uh, I'm not sure I actually need to be here at this point. That's a dog. I just about shot a dog. Vertibird showed up while I was away. Let's go back to the vertebrate. If we can get out of here. Oh god, everyone, get out of the way. <laughs> yeah, I'm still kind of sick. I got I got sick like last week. It's bad news. Don't get sick. Uh, apparently, also in the game, I'm sick. I keep forgetting to get that checked out. Usually I listen to music, but I figure that if I listen to music, it'll pop the YouTube uh, detector. Because there's always someone sitting on shitty music somewhere. It's one of the things I hate the most about YouTube. But I understand protecting your brand. Get in the vertebird. There we go. Probably could have walked home at in fact at this point. All clear. Green for uh, I've been attempting to build my base in a way that would Good uh that would make it uh guys, guys, where are we going? Uh, make it appear that people actually live there, uh, but it's a little tough in the game. Uh, also, the helicopter sound broke. I don't know what broke the helicopter blade sound, but it's broken. When I really care, I'll run uh, helicopter sounds on YouTube <laughs> in, the, in the background. Are we going to go up or are we going to go directly through the ground? We're going direct directly through the ground. So I'm going to tell you that Fallout might be a little buggy. Not sure why, you know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. So it's a little, a little problematic. Uh, if you're trying to stay, like, in real re realism here. Just me and this dog hanging out with all these people inside of each other. Um... I have a mod that gives me uh, vertebrates to use as defense. So now all of my 
places basically have at least one vertebrate flying around it. I do have the vertebrain mod, which I keep wanting to try, but it's it's very strange uh, how it works. And uh, as you can see, my base is still very much under construction. I've got uh, small rooms there, and then I haven't done anything to this side. And I've just got power armor all over the place. Because uh, I haven't made a hangar yet. Doesn't it feel good to be a part of something Let's put everything away. Is that Ellen? One robot that had an image plastered on his torso with a cowboy hat on it and said, Howdy, what's up? Fixing up. Let's get a look oh, at you. How I love destroying him. <clears throat> Sure Ellen is DLC. <laughs> or not DLC. Sure. Uh, did she get her money back yet? She sure didn't. Hey. Burp, burp. Oh. I thought I was I already had like Mark One and everyone full. That's why I came back here. What's up? Wanna swap some gear? But apparently oh. that is not the case. I hope you realize how much you did. So, uh, let's drink, have a nap, and leave. I did not want to click on workshop. Let's get all this garbage material. Out of mine inventory. Alright. One of these people, one of my people, who are now missing, as long as a robot does what it's told, uh, has just a shit ton of steel on them. <laughs> uh, but I have no idea where they went. Uh, so now we're fucked. Uh, I've been trying to figure out how the conduits are supposed to work. Uh, but they don't particularly work well. I, I'm not sure, like, how how to do that at all. Uh, and these elevators are garbage. But effective, I guess. And yeah, I've just been working on attempting to build people rooms. Keyword is attempting. Do I have one of these decked out? I had one of these I was working on, yeah. This one. Then I got dragged off to do something else while... While waiting. I'm trying to figure out how to get power up here. Apparently this... Uh... These room... Uh... Emplacements... Do carry power, but... I don't know for how far, or what. So that's why I was trying to figure out how conduits work, so I could... Either just, like, bus conduits through each room. Which would probably be the best way to do it. Do conduit, like, on the floor. For each room. Uh, like. Like, somehow get to go through the wall? Which I assume is how conduit's actually supposed to work. Uh... But I don't know how I how to do that. I do have um, these, which go through walls. But running like power lines into the into each room <coughs> and across each room, because it'd have to be like this. Helicopters here. It'd have to be like this, right? And that's ugly as fuck. I tell you what. <laughs> I guess it will let me shoot it through the wall.
On that side, at least. I don't know why it won't on this side. Like that. That could work, I guess. It's ugly, but it could work. And then you can just run that across the whole thing. You might even be able to get it straight. Tried hard enough. <laughs> but that would be an easy way to power things. Because then you could just run uh, power ports, basically. I just, I just want to figure out what the conduit is actually good for. This one does say pass through. So maybe it lets you pass through walls with the conduit. I'm not sure. Can I stay like up on the top? Yeah, like right, like right here. And if I do, if I go over here, is there anything to connect to over here? Is so that appears to be no. It feels like that's how the pass through should work. You put Yeah, it doesn't snap to anything over there. Hmm. But yeah, anyway, this, these are the problems I've been having. Uh-oh. Helicopter left without me. That's okay. We're, we were figuring stuff out. It doesn't look like you can put it any more into the wall. Maybe these walls are just too thick. Maybe it works. Maybe they work well on other walls. These are two two deep walls. So like if I pop this wall off. Yeah, apparently that conduit was in that wall. If I put this, like, here, which lets me have conduit up there, which is fine. So I'll probably just run it, like, along this wall or something like that. Yeah, okay, that works. Yeah, it's just the wall appeared to be too deep. And then I could just run the conduit, like, on the... Unless, unless it doesn't connect to that, which is incredibly annoying. stick to those? Hmm. Here's nothing sticks to those. That's bad. And not useful. Other than other conduit pass-throughs. Hmm. 
maybe these are meant to like just pass this stuff through like you have the conduit on the outside of the wall and then this passes through into the wall I have many questions about how conduits are supposed to work And then normally you can't, like, put them on a wall. They have to be on a floor. Which also doesn't make any fucking sense. And makes it incredibly hard to put them anywhere. Because then I have to, like, go over here and, like, get it. right there and then convince it to attach to the edge which is as you can see a little harder than you might expect apparently And then some of them connect and some of them don't, apparently. Man, I don't know. I don't know what these are for. But they give me the ability to have power in all these rooms if I wanted to. Although I, I would definitely prefer to run the power up rather than down. Although I guess I could attempt to run a like one of these. And then do something like this. Although, another one of the many things I don't understand how they work. I don't think I have any other vertical... ...other than this. And that doesn't exactly do what I want it to. <clears throat> I have no idea. Pretty much, I'm, this is where I'm stuck on building this place. That I can't, I can't figure out how to bring power to everyone, or at all. Conduit is the sexiest choice, but I may still have to just use, uh, just normal power cables because I, I don't get to choose. Like, I guess I could do something like that. I want it to run along the roof. Because if I did that, then we could go off of it with one of these bad boys. Maybe. 
or not? Question mark. We could, but apparently the hitbox does not turn corners particularly well. But the best way to do that would be... Oh, I can't, can't do it on that wall. Be to have it on this wall, I guess. Do that, and then do... Something like... Yeah, something like this. Some odd reason the long ass one doesn't work. So I have to do it slower. Smaller, I guess. Oh, it's not straight, that's why. I saw I was watching a streamer play this, and he seemed to have figured out how to get things to go straight. And I was definitely very jealous. Maybe there's a control I'm missing or something like that. Also, it doesn't help that I have a fuck ton of people wandering around, making my life hard. Because it's pretty much, as far as I can tell, impossible to get anything straight in this game. Probably just against the floor would be easiest. And all these conduits have like weird, weird attachment points, which doesn't make it any easier. would actually go like in the roof because it's too high. Gosh darn it. I just I just want to give these people power, man. Power to my people. If you go look outside, it's going to be like, yeah, like that. God damn it. Well, I guess I'm down here now. That's if enough of that. Yeah, this. I I have. <clears throat> I've definitely uh, made my own life hard by wanting to build this. But I believe I, I already built the wall, so we're keeping various people that we don't like out. Uh, all we gotta do now is uh, complete the wall. That is not the correct one. That one is. Yeah, I'm trying to build like a nice little shopping center area and stuff. I just... I don't know, man. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Or how, how I want to do it. I know what it is I want to do, but the tools I have are limited in certain ways. Like this. Like, why Why doesn't that one just automatically connect? Why does that connect backwards? I have many questions.
Are there any other roof panels? Apparently not. How did I even get that to fit? Does that just continue to go up? No, oh, and now see that connects. I think it's actually connecting to the top of those other buildings. That's what's going on there. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I need some stairs. There we go. But yeah, I think this will be pretty cool if I can ever get it to work. And because I want it to be pretty cool, never gonna work. Because that would be too damn easy. Or maybe because I, I purposely picked the harder thing to do. Which is also quite possible. What if we try and do it from this side? I need some flooring. Uh, vault. Trium. The vault stuff is also, I don't know, man, unnecessarily difficult to connect to each other. Okay, let's try and come at it from the other side. This stuff's definitely not made to, like, fit together in a nice way. But, uh, that never stopped me before, so I'm not going to let it stop me now. Hey, things not fitting together well. Hey, 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 God damn it. <laughs> it's not, not the correct way, and you fucking know it, video game. Please. Oh. Nope. I mean, I guess I could do that. And just have like a... Like a sweet... Uh... I, got, I gotta have some posts somewhere that I could put on that. It's very artsy. And I don't know how to make it work any other way. <laughs> so we'll just uh, go with art. See, the the game just doesn't understand my art. That's why it has all the things the wrong way. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, shit, I fell down. Yeah, look at that art right there. Could put like this here. No, that doesn't work. It's not high enough. Whatever. Art. Art. Please understand my art. I must have wooden posts somewhere. Shack Gollum. Gonna guess that doesn't go high enough. It sure doesn't. Does it snap to itself? It sure doesn't. <laughs> Ooh, 
Well, Le Fu. I'll have to find some way to make that not look horrendous. Yes, I do have these. These posts. These posts are much better in general. They still don't touch, of course. But they do sort of work like that. If I actually put a wall... Which of course does not snap. Snaps there. I'll take it. I can snap that to that. Yeah. That works. And then... These, uh, concrete wall, like, little posts are godsend. Take that stuff out, and we've got ourselves a some sort of post thing, which is better than goddamn nothing. So we can put those kind of all over the place. We could even maybe put them under, since this is where the walls. Fucking Nick. Thank you. It's where the wall's gonna end anyway, because this is going to stay. Uh, built. Clean it up a little bit more. Yeah. Yeah. And then once I figure out how to run power throughout this uh, area, uh, that'll be great. We can just run, run walls across here. And, uh, cut out the spots we need for our uh, rooms and whatnot since we're gonna move the store up there and over there uh, we're gonna figure out probably copy this sort of side piece here yeah that that works yeah that thanks for thanks for helping me out everybody by everybody I mean uh, no one uh, but you know, I want to believe you exist. I don't think I have the little pot lights I wander in here. I think they're in miscellaneous lights. These track lights. Oh, do they not stick there? Why don't they stick there? Doesn't make any sense. Those aren't, those aren't straight. Three D work is hard. Probably should have put walls on those domestic units before I put this up. Uh, but we all make mistakes. Bob says we don't make mistakes, so I'm going to go with Bob on this one. There are no limits here, I'm told. Okay. Uh, let's actually see. Can we run Conduit? Like, 
Vertical conduit junction. What does that mean? I mean we can attach conduit to the sides here. Because that would solve a lot of my problems. Can't, so, can't attach those. But can we attach... Oops. The little fingers and then attach to that? Fingers. So we attach that. Does it let us attach these? Oh boy. My life just got flipped turned upside down. I tell you what, kids. Because then I can just run this. Well, that wall's not going to stay there. All the way over here, basically. Run it over to... Oh, i got to put another finger on it. That's right. Why can't I put fingers on this? My life! Been forever ruined. Oh, I just can't put like anything over here. I wonder what happened to this spot right here. Anyway, let's take that off then. Do that. And then we can run a vertical junction. Oh, I probably should have done a wired one. that wire go inside? That'd be so useful. If it did. Looks like it sure did. I definitely think my world just got flipped turned upside down. Attach that. It'll let me put my radiator there. So now all I need to do is put power on this. If we can figure that out. Okay. And where's my closest power? Right there. Uh, we'll just we'll just pull in power from here. Who cares? And okay. Oh boy. Oh, we've learnt some things today, kids. Learn how to put conduit on a wall, and effectively means I can put conduit anywhere I want. at that point. I'm still thirsty. More water. This I am no longer needing water. I assure you. I gotta be honest with you. I feel more comfortable with Okay, in one of these rooms there should be a power line poking through the wall. As uh, far as we know. <laughs> These walls aren't that thick. Hmm. Yeah, it shouldn't be this far back. Are you certain I'm the man for the job, sir? It's my washrooms that I was working on. Where to next? Yeah, it gives us a lot more. Just a grind. Uh, I have a ton of them. A lot more ability to 
just run just stuff in general. You know what I call a good day? One that ends without an empty stomach. Fine, I'm right. hoping if we put our minds to it, we can help turn this place around. Around. Yeah, it should be right there. That actually might be in the floor. So all I need to do now is figure out how the fuck to get power into the rooms. Because I can radiate power like a motherfucker at this point. But I need just to stick some into the room. Hmm. Anyway. I think that might just be a tale for another day. This is basically what I've been doing. So, uh, I've been wondering where your split screen videos have been. Uh, they're, they're here. Me making, instead I'm just, just playing Fallout, you know. I, I could do that, I guess. At that point, this connects onto here. That would connect directly into a room. Into a rum. That is not straight at all. Kind of as expected. But, uh, you know. I think we've, we've figured out the conduit conundrum. And, uh, now we can do things like uh, move our our shops up here which would be quite nice because currently the shops are in a garbage place uh, that I just put there just to be safe can I put a roof on here in here no that's okay. We'll just have a cool, uh, cool roof sort of pattern up at the top here. This is kind of what they wanted you to get stuck on in this game. Like, oh, I'm just gonna do this one thing. Four hours later. Four hours later, you're putting floors onto a uh, area where you'll have to pull the floors up from. I just realized. Because I'll have to put up walls for the shops. So I think how I'm going to build the shops is... This is walkway. And then these will be walls. With doors. This will be like... Probably here. That. And then, uh, like big walls like that, maybe? So you can see into the shop, and the shop wall will be here. Just be like against this wall. Yeah, another one of those weird rules. Apparently you can't put a wall right there by the door. But I can put a wall right here by the door. So. I don't know. I don't know. I'd actually probably want to use. Uh, like this wall. would be That would be best. But it doesn't reach the roof. Of course. That one does. So we can have a, a very nice, like, place to put our hot oh, windows. So 
So probably like that or something. Of course, some fucking dark shit rolls in. Uh, but then you see there's a there's a hole there. So I have no idea how that's gonna work. <coughs> A lot of the different walls have like different sizes and it's incredibly annoying. Like doors, doorways generally have a different size than everything else. So like, your doorways will always be fucked up. I guess I could use these walls, they should be the right height. Codsworth, please. Yeah. These are the right height, so I also have to use these walls. Like this, this one actually has a broken window in it, so I don't actually want that one. Don't want that specific one. Thank you. But yeah, then my little storefronts can be here and figure all that shit out. And then I guess a little walkway right here along this this path here. I don't know. I just want a place to, to try and look nice. I just want it to be beautiful. Then there's oh there's always something. Like how these don't quite connect. Hmm. Anyway. I guess that'll be all. That'll be all for today. I accidentally played Fallout for an hour. Long story short. There haven't been videos because there ain't nothing to play, and I've just been playing Fallout instead of finding new things to play isn't that great. Anyway, for now, I'm Sivvy, and I'll uh, see you guys next time.